Hello, my name is Jason. I am from Washington State in a little city just south of Seattle called Burien. Uh, I have been in Washington State for a little over 20 years now, and prior to that, I was born and raised in the great state of Arizona. Until 2016, I have considered myself a proud Republican. I have gotten in many discussions with many of my friends here in the Seattle area who lean to a, in a political direction much different than myself. My very first uh, ballot for president was cast for Bob Dole, and since then I have cast ballots for Republican presidential candidates ever since in every single election, uh, including the primaries or caucuses. In 2016, uh, leading into the primaries, I was convinced that I would once again be uh, picking a Republican candidate for president. Personally, I was a fan of John Kasich, um, but it didn't work out. We know what happened. Um, I did not vote for Trump in 2016. I will never vote for Trump. Uh, the day I knew I would not vote for Trump was the day he insulted John McCain when uh, he openly mocked John McCain for being captured. John McCain, a war hero who has done more for this country than anybody in the Trump family combined will ever do for this country. 2020, uh, I will not vote for Trump again. Um, as of now, I will be voting for Joe Biden. Um, unless the Republicans can somehow pull their heads out of their rear ends and not nominate him at the convention. But not only that, they're going to have to pick a candidate who's not just been a follower. The Republicans have been lemmings these last few years. They have disappointed me to no end in in their their cowardice and just how they have forgotten what republican values mean and they've just gotten behind this horrible human being i still lean republican for sure i still have many many republican values i'm very pro-life uh, i support states rights i support less government lower taxes strong defense all of that uh, what i do not support what i do not support is having a horrible human being as our leader. I do not support lifting to the most powerful office in the world, somebody who cares much more about his ratings than he ever does about you or me. Um, I've watched as, as he's taken children from their families and locked them in cages. Uh, I've watched as he's insulted veterans. I've watched as he's insulted Gold Star families. I've watched how he has shaken hands and stood for photo opportunities with Kim Jong-un. Uh, I've watched even recently how he has tear gassed peaceful protesters. It's amazing to me at how we can get all riled up and we can march in favor of the Second Amendment, but we seem to have forgotten that the right to protest is a part of the First Amendment. We seem to have forgotten all about that and we're okay now with, with pushing back peaceful protesters. Anyway, uh, as of now, I will I will be voting for Joe Biden. I hope everybody else does. Um, I hope that we can get out of this mess that we're in right now. And I hope that we can rebuild our reputation, not only with our own people here in America, but with our allies. It's time to remember what America is and what America isn't is a bully led by a vain narcissist. So uh, Joe Biden, 2020. Good luck.